Hey gang, we're here at Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida. We're doing some kids stuff today. We might do the DreamWorks experience. And then we're uh, looking at some of the props that are set up here for HHN. Come along with us as we uh, go explore the parks. Now right here, we see that the uh, props for the scare zone. We're setting these up right here, anticipating the Arrival of HHN, which as of this recording is only like 33, 34 days away. Um, it's going to be where actors kind of like basically pop in, pop out, gives them something to stand on. That little, that little door right there will give them somewhere to hide. Exciting, exciting times. Then as we were waiting for crepes, we saw that characters were coming out. Here we have SpongeBob and the gang doing doing their thing, doing great. And then the minions and Gru came out after that. Really, uh, really fantastic experience. They seem to come out into the same courtyard both times, and this seems to just be a rotation uh, of characters ever since they got rid of the parade that used to come out of this door. All right, time for some crepes, gang. Here's a quick look at the menu and everything that you can get. What do you think about it? Right, we have a smoked brisket crepe right here. And then over here we have a cookies and cream crepe. We're gonna dig right into these and see how they taste. All right, so we just ate the crepes. Yeah, what did you think? So we had the Oreo, I loved it, but it was literally kind of good, but a little sugary. It was sugary, it was very sweet, yeah, I agree. But it was delicious, especially as you got towards the bottom. Uh, it was more like a ricotta kind of base. It was good. Uh, we loved the smoked brisket one. Uh, it was uh, really great. Daddy, I tell something? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, so because slushy is blue, it's blue raspberry. Blue raspberry? Yes, yes. It's a little bit sour, but just get it thumbs up. Yeah, thumbs up. Nice. Uh, the smoked brisket crepe was fantastic. We really liked how delicious it was. With a little bit of the, what was it, kale you said? It tasted like kale. Had yeah, a little yeah. crunch to it. A little crunch to it. It was a little crunch to it. And what did you like? I like the brisket. Yeah. You didn't even have the brisket. <laughs> All right. We're going to go uh, walk around the park. All right, gang. After we had some crepes, we decided to check out the DreamWorks character experience. Now, this is where they used to hold Barney and friends. Uh, and I have to say, it is, this is a great experience for both kids and adults. It's inside, it's air conditioned. There's benches all around. And as you can see right here, they're swapping out characters. They just had Guy Diamond and another character that I can't remember off the top of my head. But then it switches into, you know, one of the penguins from Madagascar, King Julian, Puss in Boots. Just a really great experience. Kids can go up, dance, and take pictures, and it's really, really nice. I feel like, even though she likes this ride, Woody Woodpecker is kind of lost on this current generation, but I like it. Always fun. After Woody Woodpeckers, uh, we went over onto the water slide with just Betty Furbish. She really liked that. Just really uh, a really gorgeous afternoon at Hollywood and the Universal Studios. Just really nice. We can hang out. 
two things that you don't normally do. You know? uh, Harry Potter was uh, busy as usual. So, you know, you can always tell how busy the park is if you go to Harry Potter. This is, this will always be the busiest location. But I think we're going to grab some ice cream and uh, see how that goes. So we got in line here. We waited about 25 minutes. Here you see the selection of toppings, all you know, ranging in prices from expensive to too expensive. And then you have the Sundays right here. We decided to go with the butter beer soft serve and my daughter got strawberries and vanilla. And then we come down here to Nocturne Alley, guys. Really love Nocturne Alley. Um, it's air conditioned down here and there's not a ton of people down here. Most of the people doing wands and stuff. So this is a great place to duck out of the heat for a little bit. Just got on uh, Escape from Gringotts with Express. Actually, only took uh, 20 minutes with a posted 65 minute wait time, so that was pretty nice. We're probably gonna head out now. It's been a day, it's been hot. Lacking in the distance. We out, we gotta go. Yeah, it's close. Rip Ride Rocket isn't running, so lightning is definitely close. All right, well, that's it for us. Oh, yeah, and the minions as we walk out here. See some of the minions. Nice seasonal booth here. The Arepas. Very nice. And then Minions. Hello. Anticipation for this being another Minions ride. On a universal. Arch in the distance as we make our way to the exit. One day today, Cafe. One day. Just, I don't know, it's always an afterthought as we leave to go eat at the Today Cafe. I've heard nothing but good things. One day. All right, gang. We're here at the end of the day, universal wall behind us spinning. I feel like we had a great time. I feel like we uh, were productive, got some things done, had some great food. Thanks for joining us. Hope to see you on the next one.